Okay, we have everybody, yes, yes, JP is over there. That's awesome. There are, there's not going to be any one-on-ones afterwards with Paul, so if you've got questions, this is the forum to do it. Frank, we ready? Uh, yeah, can you see if you going? Yes. Everybody going? Be good? White balance? Yes? All right, you're good. All right, I appreciate everybody being here. Let me start off by saying that we have very high expectations for our women's basketball program. And I, I think in large part those expectations are due to past success, to our investment in the program, to great tradition, and probably as significant as anything, the best women's basketball fans I think in the country. We expect to be leaders in, in the Mountain West. Uh, we've traditionally been a leader in the Mountain West in women's basketball and that's where we expect to be. I also think our program should be nationally relevant. We need to consistently compete for uh, and participate in the NCAA tournament or the NIT tournament. And frankly, that's not happening. Um, these high expectations are not being met. We've, for lack of a better word, I think we've fallen into mediocrity. And, and that's simply not acceptable. Coach Sanchez has been the head basketball coach at the University of New Mexico for five years. Uh, I believe that five years is enough time for a head coach to really develop and produce a quality program. And I think the logical question really is uh, why extend Coach Sanchez last year? Last year, uh, Coach Sanchez was named Coach of the Year in the Mountain West. We finished second in the regular season. We finished second in the tournament. I think at that point in time, it was logical to look at a, uh, an extension. Uh, the, it, it appeared the program was moving in the right direction. A year later, we were picked to finish second in the league, essentially the same team back but one player, uh, a top recruiting class coming in. And we finished, I believe, fifth in the league. And, and keep in mind, this is a, right now, unfortunately, a very average Mountain West Conference. It's not the Mountain West Conference of old. We were 17 and 15, barely above 500. And it, it culminated with a, a loss Wednesday night to the fifth place team in the Big Sky Conference. Um, I think when you step back and take a look at it, we've been very inconsistent over the years. And, and really the bottom line is Coach Sanchez in five years her overall record is 77 and 81. Her record in the Mountain West Conference is 40 and 44. We've only had one winning season in the Mountain West. I think at the University of New Mexico, our women's basketball program with our fan base, with our facilities, with the investment that we have in our coaching staff, that we need to do better. Uh, I, I, along with Janice Ruggiero, informed Coach Sanchez this morning 9 o'clock this morning that we would be terminating our contract. And, you know, there's a business side to what we do. And, and, and it can be at times very painful. Yvonne Sanchez is a very good person. She's a New Mexican. She spent 16 years, I believe, with our, with our women's basketball program. She is a quality individual. This is a tough, painful, uncomfortable decision. But, but the business side to what we do, after five years, we need to win games. This is, this is really what it comes down to, is simply not winning enough basketball games. And a belief that five years is ample time to, to produce the kind of program that, that this institution, our fan base, deserves. So I'll stop there and answer questions. 